everybody test check one two it's that time it's that time but first let me introduce phil ginsburg the general manager of san francisco parks and rec is going to introduce the mayor let's welcome phil ginsburg yes what's up everybody happy holidays, happy holidays. welcome back after a really difficult couple of years Welcome back to Golden Gate Park and McLaren Lodge. It's crazy out here. So, first thing I want to do is let's hear it for our incredible MC, Unique Derek. Thank you, Unique. All right. So my job is to welcome you all to the annual lighting of our beloved Uncle John's tree and the kickoff of Winter Lights, an illuminated outdoor experience for all ages, brought to you by the Recreation and Park Department, the San Francisco Parks Alliance, Illuminate, the Conservatory of Flowers and the National AIDS Memorial Grove. Oh. Hey, all right. I only have about 20 more minutes. It'll be good. No, really. All right. So let's talk about how important this celebration is. This special VIP, who I'm going to bring up in a second, has been lighting holiday trees and menorahs all over the city for a week. But Madam Mayor, there ain't only one city holiday tree, and it's right behind you. And let me tell you a little bit about this tree, because to understand this tree is to understand our city and to understand Golden Gate Park. This tree, Uncle John's tree, named after John McLaren, who was the longest serving parks director in city history, 56 years. Madam Mayor, you know who's second? <laughs> Uncle John's tree is a Monterey Cypress. It was planted in 1896. That's 125 years ago. This ceremony tonight, this ceremony tonight has been going on since 1930, which is the first time this tree was lit. So we are here on its 91st year, which is pretty amazing. And Madam Mayor, Mayors have been coming to this tree lighting since 1970, started by Mayor Aliota. Every mayor has graced their presence at this tree lighting for 51 years. That's longer than the mayor has been alive. So with that history in mind, Golden Gate Park is always magical during the holiday season. And this year, Madam Mayor, it's bigger and better than ever. So let me tell you, let me walk you all. We're gonna light the tree. But afterwards, we're gonna walk down to the uh, music concourse for part two. And you're gonna see all the magic. So let me tell you about the magic. Right down here is entwined one of the most pop popular installations of all time. This is an illuminated meadow of interchanging lights. It's fantastic. Right across from Entwined and actually a little closer to us is the Circle of Light, an exhibit that was just two nights ago in the AIDS Memorial Grove and is now right here. You keep walking down towards the music concourse and you see the Conservatory of Flowers. It's all lit up. And then you keep walking past the, how many people went on the sled tonight? Let's give it up for the Recreation and Park Department for bringing snow. And then we keep going and all the trees, all the trees around car-free JFK, they're all lit up. And then we work our way into the music concourse and there's going to be free music on the music band channel and that big old 150 foot Ferris wheels all lit up. That's how we celebrate the holidays in San Francisco. All right, so a few thank yous, and then I'm going to bring up the woman who's in charge of lighting this tree, 
but I want to thank all of our wonderful artists and performers. Charles Gadigan, who's done, a, uh, who's done Entwine for us. Charles is here. Joshua Hubert, who's lit up all the trees. Uh, Oliver Nietzsche, who uh, did the Circle of Light. Dana King, who did the incredible exhibit, uh, uh, Monumental Reckoning in the Music Concourse. Ben Davis, who's here, who lit up the band shell. Unique Derek, Lion Dance Me, DJ G Reader, Reed Fromer, and David Magus and Boswick. And I want to thank you to all our partners, the Parks Alliance, Illuminate, Conservatory of Flowers, the Memorial Grove. And then behind me, we have some amazing people. We have our San Francisco Recreation and Park Commissioners, chaired by our president, Mark Buell. We have our entire elected family, incredible department heads, our entire Recreation and Park Commission, our staff who worked so hard to put this on. And then a special thank you to all our kids who are on stage. We're part of our Peace Parks program. Peace Parks is a partnership between Rec and Park and our San Francisco Police Department and offers safe spaces. That's what parks are, safe spaces for healthy recreation for park visitors of all ages. We're building job and leadership skills, boosting college readiness, and actually giving kids a good time. Over the last four years, Rec and Park has hired 100 kids from our Peace Park programs in just four years. So we have 100 kids from Peace Parks working for us, but tonight, their only job is to help us with the countdown. And you know who else is helping us with the countdown? We call her our park champion in chief. She's everywhere. She's keeping our city safe. She's keeping people working. She's keeping people happy because she loves the fun and she loves her parks. And she's been all over the last couple of weeks lighting trees. But tonight, Madam Mayor, is the night. So give it up for our mayor, the Honorable Linda Breen. Well, first of all, I don't think I've ever seen this many people at this tree lighting and it just makes me so happy because as you know last year we couldn't come together in the same way but we're here to celebrate the holidays and it just takes me back when I was a kid and I used to beg my grandma please mama please I want this doll for Christmas and please mama please can we go downtown to Woolworth where we can get toys and have fun and my grandmother would say, only if you did good, only if you did your homework, only if you listened. And I tried my best, I did the best I could. But during the holiday season, I can't help but think of the memories when I was a kid and, and what the time that I spent in San Francisco and, and looking at the kids here now and thinking about the memories that they're creating. They're gonna remember the days that they came here with mom and dad and grandma and uncles and just the different programs to light this tree. So just remember this moment, remember where you are and remember who you were with because today we're creating memories. And I wanna take this opportunity to really thank the Rec and Park Department for all the work this pandemic. Let me tell you, this pandemic has been hard on so many of us and because our parks were still open and available to us, it was really the only sanity I'm sure many of us had, especially the parents. And I wanna thank them for their work and all the commissioners that are here. Thank you to the families and all the people in San Francisco. And last but not least, before we light this tree, because I know we're tired of hearing talk, we wanna hang out and have fun and drink hot chocolate. I just wanna say, we're at about 78% of San Franciscans that are fully vaccinated. So I am really excited about continuing to reopen our city, continuing to enjoy the holidays. So at this time, it is time to light the largest tree in San Francisco to celebrate the holidays. Happy holidays, Merry Christmas, Happy Hanukkah, and all those holidays in between. Phil, can we get this thing started? You count it down, Mary. You count it down.
Count it down. You can help me count it down. All right, let's go. Are you guys helping? We'll start. We'll start with Ted, and then Mayor. Let's show them the switch. There's the switch. Okay, you want to do the switch? All right. Who wants the switch? Not yet. Not yet. We're gonna count down. Are we ready? We're gonna start with ten, and then we're gonna count backwards. Are we ready? All right, ten, nine. Happy holidays, everyone.